So this is chapter three, number seven. There's a trick to this, and I've done this at least three times this year, this particular problem. So the first thing you do is you let y equal x squared plus 2x minus 1 to the 1 half. And now we take the derivative. So you bring the 1 half down, rewrite the argument, subtract 1. Don't forget to subtract, so you get negative 1 half times the derivative of what's inside. So the derivative of x squared is 2x, and the derivative of 2x is 2. Now this can be factored as 2x plus 1, and the 2s can cancel. And so then I'm left with x plus 1 on the top, and then I bring the x squared plus 2x minus 1 to the 1 half at the bottom, but I write it with the square root. Now if you go back to the original, you see that y equals the square root of x squared of plus 2x minus 1. So that equals that. So instead of that, I can write y. It was a little bit of a trick. x plus 1 over y, which equals a.